Dr. Liu Yanggu from China Society of International Exchange of, Prof of Professionals. Which are, um, you say that China is now a, a country both of immigration and emigration, but which are favorite destination of uh, China immigrants and um, which nationality are immigrants that arrive in China? You know, in my presentation, I uh, elaborated the immigration of the highly skilled workers. So, uh, as I said in the presentation, uh, with the uh, opening up and the reform policy, China opened its door to welcome the skilled workers coming from all over the world, including European countries. And this is because China, uh, in terms of its uh, development process, uh, is really in need of human capital, not only at home but also in the world. It is in line with the globalized economy, so China wants to join and uh, enjoy the benefit from the international migration process. But does China in this moment really need, really need the immigration or really need human capital or not? Yes, China is really need the, the high quality human capital uh, to uh, contribute to its quality development process. And you spoke about uh, Chinese professionals who study or work abroad, but which are the main difficulties they have when they start to, stu to study or to, to work abroad? I don't think they have uh, any big problems because of the uh, hardship, hard work, because of the, uh, the opportunities offered by the other countries. Generally, my personal understanding, uh, they are fine with uh, life and study and work in the other countries.